I'm working on the transmission mount now and uh, I've roughly drawn it in so something like this and now I'll cut it out and see if it fits or if it needs any any changes so I just drawn it in bit by bit and just measuring Okay, time to test. So it hits the fuel line, which uh, doesn't worry me because I'm gonna get rid of these lines anyway. Doesn't look too bad.
ready to remove my rope now and see how it works. So he really is bolted in. I don't know how. It's fairly stiff, so if it is too soft, I can always go back to poly. But it's um, yeah, it's not actually hitting anywhere at the moment. But it's it's just really really close in a couple of spots. Here's my homemade tool. We'll see if it's strong enough. worked. So here's the fuel sender, and uh, I have bought the Walbro GS S342G3 pump, and you can see that it's exactly the same size as, as the original, so it shouldn't be hard to mount it on which I will do tomorrow. This looks a bit rusty. I'm not too sure if it still works. I'll probably measure it before I put it back in. But the tank has been almost empty and for, yeah, who knows how many years. <laughs> 